Hi, um, you've got lots of pictures of this today, but I thought a video might help as well with explaining what's going on. So I've been stitching in a lot of notebooks, as you know, if you follow my blog regularly. Um, and within the notebooks, so they're just paper notebooks. Um, but sometimes if I'm working, so for example, if I wanted to work here next, I'd struggle to keep that open, wouldn't I? So I've made, for all of them, little overlays that are stitched into the front and that which just lay over like that, just to give me a bit of a help when I'm working on a page. Um, it's stitched into the front, like I say. So if I wanted to come back, for example, and add something to here, this one not so much put, coming over, but that would lay over there. So this is movable. It's almost like a fabric bookmark, I guess. So I'm just kind of consumed with wrapping and things now. Um, so for one of my other notebooks, I'll get it just a minute. So for one of my other notebooks, I've made wraps that go both ways. So this one is a tiny one, okay, oops, and this one has got a movable over there one, okay, but it's also got one that goes the other way. So one that goes that way to properly bind it. Um, and I'm just consumed with wrapping things and I guess maybe it goes back to my original way, way back where I was consuming wrapping cloths. These are wrapping cloths, aren't they? But in a different form. So this one, what I wanted to do, so the notebook isn't attached to this. That's the inside, that's the lining, and that's the outside. Um, but I wanted to be able to wrap it up. Have I done it? I'm almost certain. Yeah, that it goes on that line, or maybe that goes on that line. That, no. What's going on, Karen? That's it. So it's like that, okay, because this tie here goes there. Then that comes over and ties like that. And it's just, to be honest, I could go on forever. There's nothing to stop me now making another one that wraps it up that way, but you know what I mean? It'd be like past the parcel, wouldn't it? Maybe we could have a virtual game of past the parcel. So that's what I'm thinking anyway, that's what I'm doing. And there might actually, I've got other notebooks as well. I'm trying to work on something else at the minute, but I've got such an itch and an urge to make one of these for this and the other notebooks, but I'm trying to restrain myself. So I just thought I would do a quick video to just explain that to you, what's going on. And to be perfectly honest with you, it stores safely, more safely, like this, than it does even like this. Um, they're just sitting on a shelf. Um, but it is more secure, I think, like that. Um, better able to preserve it and to stop it getting creased, etc. So I just wanted to, and I haven't spoke to you for ages. Hi, how are you doing? Uh, weird times we're living in. Just can't quite get my head around it. But I hope if you're a bit stuck with something to do, the free embroidery class, I mean, there's some stuff in there that you might think, why would I do that? Um, but just take from it what you want. Have a look through what's already been posted. There might be a stitch you've always wanted to learn that's in there. And there'll be more of that coming week by week until the whole thing's been uploaded. Um, and if you've got any queries about that as well, I'm here. So, hi. Hope you're all safe, stay safe, hope all your loved ones are safe and let's just work our way through this as best we can I guess.